Hi guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori and I have a mess. I have a Dollar Tree haul for you today. It's a pretty big one too, so I'm excited. Hi Luna, you wanna say hi? Come here. This is my niece Sarah's dog, Luna. She's visiting for the weekend, right? Say hi. Can you say hi? Yeah, all right, here's a bone for you. Oh, this dog, there you go. I got these at the Dollar Tree. They are 100% raw hide free. Uh, they are bare bones, peanut butter and chicken flavored. She likes them. Okay, what did I get? I got a whole bunch of stuff and it's all over the place. So, first things first, I got this Queen V body soap. It's good for intimate places, apparently. It's a cleansing bar, micro V I'm own friendly and pH balance, wild berry, uh, developed with a gynecologist, free from parabens and soap. And it's a bar. So we're going to try it. Maybe I'll take this with me on vacation instead of shower gel. If it's, um, doesn't dry me out. I picked up a two pack of these. I really just wanted it for a spray bottle. I haven't decided if I'm gonna take this. I have to try it out or order one, but I need one for my hair. Um, if I, on a day, today has been raining, so I'm a disaster, but on days that I don't wash it, I just spray it with water to get my curls back. Um, and then this I can use for whatever. But I really, oop, just got it for this. But I may order one also from uh, the, the old Amazon. So we'll put that here for now. Oh, I need my bag. Those things are going upstairs. Um, also, if you need alcohol wipes, I get mine at the Dollar Tree. Um, I like them. I use them for my diabetes because I take a shot once a week and I have a Dexcom. But also for my first aid kit. I'm just gonna put a couple of these for my travel first aid kit that I'm creating. Three or four of these wipes is plenty. You can also use them um, to wipe off like your phone or electronics or something. But keep in mind, I learned this from a doctor on TikTok that I think I mentioned this before, but alcohol does not kill the norovirus, the stomach bug, but it'll clean up everything else. You can wipe your electronics or whatever. So I usually put like four in my little first aid kit and then the rest just go in my bathroom. And I use them, you know, when I take my shots and whatever. Um, I grabbed these, these come out at springtime and this, these are Jot brand scissors, but let me tell you, these are the good ones. They're pretty sturdy. I keep a set in my kitchen and my old set needs to be thrown away. But these are good and solid and heavy scissors and they work fantastic. They're the ones that have the painted design and they're a little heavier. So I use these for, hi, for, cra ouch, for crafting, but these are my kitchen scissors. So I need to, to do that. Now it was time to replace it. For some household chores, this is a great razor blade. Um, what are they calling it? Scraper with blades. This is a nice one. The other one is metal and I felt like my hand slipped. I feel like this one's going to be better. I have some, a sticker goo on my car window that I need to get off. And I also have a glass cooktop on my stove and this comes in handy. And the metal one, I feel like I didn't care for it. So I saw that and was like, perf. And it comes with a little container of extra blades. And for, well, for now, $1.25, I did hear at one of my stores, um, the gentleman was saying that our Dollar Trees are going up to $1.50 and the plus section is going up to $7. I have some Powerade, Gatorade Zero with protein. Mm. It's okay. Just okay. For my travel kit, I did grab one of these. I will keep this in with my like, probably with like my first 80 type stuff or things for the airplane and my hotel. I mean, you never know, to be fair. It's so minimal, it was so lightweight. 
but it's a nice little flashlight that works. It's also magnetic. So when I'm on the cruise ship, I can stick it to the wall. I may have to glue a magnet on the back, but this is definitely going in my cruise stuff in my little bag for like first aid type things of that nature. And I'll show you the bag I'm using actually, I think, oh, look at these. It's a little wicker makeup bag, I think they're calling it. Summer wristlet. I don't know that I would trust this as a wristlet to like carry around money and stuff, but it is, I mean, it's not lined, but it weighs nothing. So my little alcohol swipe wipes, my little flashlight, any of my little first aid, my band-aid, stuff like that. Stick this right down in my bag. Everything is together and I know where it's at and it doesn't weigh anything. And that's what's important to me for travel. They had it in this color, cream and a pink, but I just really loved this blue. It's so fun. I love a good wicker. I actually have a basket over here. I'm collecting all of my Dollar Tree travel items that I've been buying and I'm gonna do one video. Um, I did pick up some more Dole. This is the Tropical Splash. I've not tried this yet, but the Dole is new to me. Six packets. Honestly, once Dollar Tree goes up, I won't probably buy drink mixes there anymore because then they will be very much more expensive than Walmart. Oh, Dubby's choking over there. Um, I got because I wanted to use it for some recipe. Although I don't know. It's a lot of carbohydrates in here, but we'll see. Just onion soup mix to go in the kitchen with my food. That wasn't exciting. Okay, for travel. I grabbed, these are bonnets. They're a little bigger than the other shower caps and they're better quality and I love the print. They are a shower cap, but they're a bonnet. You put your shoes when you travel. You stick your shoes in here. And if you're gonna separate your shoes, like for better packing, you just use one for each shoe. But it keeps the dirt from the bottom of your shoe off your clothes. Um, and these are fantastic. And these are, you only get two, but they are a better quality. So I feel like it's not gonna tear and get messed up before I get home. From my trip. You can use these for lots of things also, like a bowl cover. But it came this one came in two prints. Also, I can use it for my hair if I want. I don't want, but I could. So I'm gonna put these in. I think I'm only taking one extra pair of shoes when I go in July. So I may only need one of these, but I will probably put each tennis shoe in one, and that way I don't have to shove them together. I don't have to put them together because you can, you know, maneuver them around. You know what I'm saying. Uh, for the shower, I grabbed one of these. It's just a body loofah. It's a glove. You put it on your hand. It's really rough and it's great for dry skin. It kind of exfoliates and sloughs off all that dead skin. That's for me for my shower. For summertime, I like to do like picnics and stuff. Um, and they always come out with these colorful cutlery set so forks knife spoons you get I don't know eight of each yeah eight of each but these are a nice quality like they're a heavy duty and I like that opposed to the cheap flimsy ones so I try to grab a pack when I at the beginning of the summer usually that's enough for me depending on how many picnics I go to I guess and then I bring them home and wash them because they're that star, they're that solid. I can get multiple uses out of out of those for sure. I want a little nutso. I don't know where the other one is. Ah, here we go. I love these little bags. They're in the craft section. They're just a little zip top bag, resealable. They're the perfect size. I got five packs. I use them for lots of things. I, all, I use them for my Etsy store when I'm selling like little, I make um, needles, decorative needles for counting stitches. I use them for that, but I'm also using them for table make gifts because they're just perfect size. And I've been having a hard time finding them at some of my stores. I think I 
the last two weeks I may have been to five different different stores and I only found them at one. So I bought them. I bought all of them. No, I didn't. There was a ton left, but I bought them. Um, oh, I found some some of the spring doodahs. Let me get this mess out of my way. So this is lips, eyes, it says lips, eyes, face. And I think it's to put your brushes or makeup in, which I think is fun. And I love the color. And honestly, they had it in black and pink, but I liked the pink. But if you sit it this way up against the wall, you really don't see the writing. So you can see the writing or not see the writing. So I like that. If you put it this way and on your desk, you can put like pens and stuff in it. You can spray paint it. You can put stickers over it or you can just leave it. And I'm wondering if a uh, nail polish remover would take off the... I don't know. Feeling better, Wellington? He had a little upset stomach today. So I grabbed that and then I picked up this for me. And I've already mentioned before that I don't know if I love their makeup sponges, but um, I 100% love this little stand for it. It's rose gold. It's springy. I mean, I guess technically you could travel with it. I wouldn't, but you could. And then you just put your used, after you use your beauty blender, you just sit it in there and then it dries. Because if you put these away and they're wet, you can get bacteria and stuff. Like you should wash them often. And then you sit it in something like that on your bathroom sink and it keeps it dry. And it helps it dry. It keeps it from growing bacteria. That's what I'm saying. Did I mention this is in no particular order? Okay, good. Um, I just grabbed this ice cube tray because it has a lid. And I really liked, I think I showed you in another video that I freeze um, coffee and then I blend it with milk and make like a fra uh, frappe. And so my thought is this is better. It's not going to spill in my freezer because the little one with the Easter bunnies did. Plus this will hold more coffee. Um, also you can just pour it in here. It'll fill up each one and when it's frozen, Somehow you get the lid off. It's it's on here good. I don't think it's taped on here, is it? Nope, you just pop the lid off and then you can take your ice cubes out. And it has like a ridge on the side so it doesn't spill. I like that. They had it in white and blue, but I liked the little fill spout because then I could just make my coffee, pour it in, it'll self-settle, self -settle, freeze it, and then I have my ice cube, my coffee cubes. So we need that. Um, I picked up one more pack of these for travel. These are, they're calling them face sponges, but they're just sponges. I mean, there's no, there's nothing that makes these not a dish sponge. And I've talked about on my other videos that I travel with these and I use them with, um, I got some soap flakes that work well that are hand and for hands and dishes. I think it's just Castile soap, which is safe for anything. There's no fragrance or moisturizer in these little flakes. So I can wash my coffee mugs and my travel water bottles because I don't drink just water. I drink crystal light. So I have to, I like to wash it out. So I grabbed two more of these because I have two trips coming up. So that'll go in my little Jolly Tree. Um, for a trip, I grabbed another, a new comb. It's just a comb. I have curly hair, so I don't brush my hair. I comb it. And I'll show you. These are my favorite. I know I have the window open, Luna. It's just a comb. Um, but I like it because also it's flat. And I'll just throw this in my toiletry bag and I'll leave it there. I have one already upstairs. So I grabbed one for travel. It'll just go in my toiletry bag and it will just stay in my toiletry bag. I don't like to have to keep packing and unpacking. So if there are things like that that I can have duplicates of, I don't mind for a dollar. Um, for a gift, I mean, it's not really a gift. My niece, Sarah, so that's Luna's mom. She's my niece. Her bestie has a baby and he will be one next month. And I bought him some presents and I saw this and I thought, well, they, who can't use a little toothbrush? 
So I'm just throwing it in with it. It's not really a gift, but I thought it was adorable. And it's a two pack and he can learn to brush his own teeth. So that's just a little throw it in there. I'm super excited. I found the sun-kissed peach. Um, also, you know where else I should go to get these? Dollar General. And you know who's going to become cheaper than the Dollar Tree? Dollar General. I know. Um, because they're still a dollar at Dollar General. So I will probably go there for my drink mixes. But I was there today and I saw it. And it's peach. Heck, I think I have almost enough for the summer now. I know. Okay, other beauty products that I found. Eco Tools. These are definitely not Dollar Tree brand. I get these all over the place. They have it at Ulta. And I actually used this one already. I have another one. It's a face scrubber, like a face cleaner. It's a little more abrasive than the cloth. So like when you're, you know, you can use it to wash your face. Um, and it's biodegradable which I think is fantastic. I love that it's biodegradable. So that will definitely, the one I have for here, I have in my bathroom already. I will just keep using it. And that one I will put in my travel kit. This one, packaging has seen better days, but it was the only one I saw. So I'll take it out and show you what it looks like. I even have a little string on it. But I will pack this up and take it with me too. Now, I don't think, yeah, this is not a mitt. This is just Eco Tools Planet Me. And it's just a sponge. So if you've never traveled abroad, like to Europe, sometimes hotels don't have washcloths. I don't know if that's an American thing. I don't know. But I have been to hotels before where you have to just, they don't have washcloths, which is fine. So I always pack one. I pack like a washcloth or a sponge or a loofah, but I will be packing this. And I noticed that when I used it for my face the other day and I wrung it out, it was, it dried quickly. So if I'm traveling, I can just, you know, put it in my bag and it'll be fine till I get to my next destination and take it out. But you know, I need something to wash my body and it's lightweight and it, you know, it's a sponge. So I have my little set. Definitely not a Dollar Tree find. I mean, Dollar Tree product. Also not a Dollar Tree product, so I don't know if you'll find these. This is the brand called Lumin. L-U-M-I-N. I looked these up. The bigger packaging are like $30. I don't know how much this size is. This is for men. It's formulated for men. This is a charcoal face wash for all skin types. It smells very like men's cologne, which I love. And then this one is for dry skin. It's a face moisturizer duo. And the packaging is like spot on. So I may let somebody <clears throat> use the product and then give me the packaging back because I can use it for my own face wash. Or I could just use this. But I love the packaging. This is, mm, it just smells like men's cologne. Charcoal face wash. I mean, I don't think there's a reason I can't use it other than I, I have a hard time with perfumed things. My skin dries out. So this is a, these are one fluid ounce. So Father's Day is coming up. If you see them, grab a few. Grab a few. I'm throwing things. Grab a few for Father's Day. Especially if your father or husband is into skincare because that's pretty cool. Um, this is brand new to me. These are clay art crafting tools. So I have these in wood, but these are plastic and they're just little tools that you can use to shape your clay. This one I am particularly interested in as well as this one to make holes in things, which is lovely. So they have these, which is new. But then at a different store for clay, they have these, I don't know if you can see it, these little tiny cookie cutters. I mean, but they're clay cutters. So this one has a circle, an octagon, a heart, and a star. And this one has a flower, a teardrop, a butterfly, and a rectangle. And then they had one that was like circle square. I didn't get the third one that I saw. But can you believe it? Hi. 
Can you believe it? I know. So I grabbed those for my pottery when I go back to my pottery class. Because these little tools are always helpful when you have to get into small spaces and stuff. And when I can find them for $1.25, yes, please. Let's see. Oh, I had mentioned these the other day for my first aid kit. These are hydrocolloid bandages. So they are advanced healing. They are waterproof, impermeable, promotes moist environment for faster healing. Um, you get 10 band-aids in here. I don't know what, well, they are, oh, 7 eighths inch by 15.8 inch. So, you know, if you get a finger cut or blister, you can put this on there. And I know some people use these for um, acne. So, yeah, for 10 of them for $1.25 is not bad. And these will be perfect in my first aid kit. Right, Rooney Tunes? Right. Um, they brought these back in the summer section, the drink stirs. I use them for my coffee bar. What is that? Oh, error. Somebody's using their leaf blower. I am a uh, basic like that. So these will go in my coffee bar for my stirs for the summer. And speaking of, and I don't remember seeing these last year, but I could be wrong. They have little plate sets, plate and bowl. So you get a pineapple bowl and plate. And I love the plates that have the high sides. And did I mention that I like to eat outside of my patio? And then they have the watermelon set. I'm dying here. They also had a lime. I didn't need the lime, but I did get, here, we'll do this for a thumbnail. Right, Looney? Luna. So they have the little sets. Um, I don't think they're dishwasher safe. I wouldn't put them in the microwave. Um, yeah, I, I wouldn't do any of those things. I probably wouldn't even put like a super hot off the grill anything. I'm thinking this would be a perfect fruit bowl. Or even like chips and dip. Just out, you know, like little fun stuff. Yes, I'm peeling tags. You guys know they make me crazy, right? Hey, we all have issues in life. Mine are tags. Um, so yeah, I got these for just to have my summer meals outside. I like to sit on my back patio in the summertime in the evening and have dinner or snack while I'm reading or something. Um, and so... These will be fun with my coffee stirs. So my store is starting to see summer stuff, in case you didn't catch on to that. All right, we just have a few more things. Also in the summer stuff, I bought, I grabbed these, which are um, just drink cups. Let me see here. Again, I wouldn't... They're shaped like a coffee cup. I would not put hot liquids in these. I would not put them in the dishwasher. I would definitely not put them in the microwave. I think these are for our cold drinks more so than anything else. Um, but like I said, I go to picnic with the pops downtown fairly regularly with my friends. And I thought these would be perfect if I made a brought a drinks. I mean, alcoholic or not, it doesn't matter and ice and then I can just fill them up and drink out of them and they're fun they are a little you know I probably wouldn't give them to a child that doesn't know how to um not that they don't know how to but they don't know their own strength and they start squeezing things super hard then you start getting break you know leakage but the lid was on there pretty tight and they say uh, summer days. So what I would do is make a beverage of my choice, iced coffee, whatever, bring ice, put it in here and pour it in top, drink it, keep the rest in the cooler. That's what I would do. And same thing with this silverware. I mean, these plates and the silverware, I keep it all together. And then when I go picnicking wherever, I just put it in my cooler. You're okay, Alex. Um, I grabbed some nail polish, this pink color for summer. Never tried this brand, Color Vibe. It says gel like. I don't know. I mean, it looks fine. 
It looked a little thin, so I may have to put a couple coats on, but I really love these muted colors. So maybe I'll use this today because it's time to change the polish. And we have two other things. This is in the travel section as well. You get two of these. They had this color, purple and something, and then like red and pink. And I opted for these, which also, again, first aid kit right here could be. Um, it has the little, nice little snap. Open it up and you just put whatever. Q-tips, uh, flossers, band-aids, wipes, some gel, you know, some antibiotic ointment pads, whatever. Put it in here and it just keeps things separate. And then there's this size which makeup, brushes, I mean, whatever. I just, I made myself only get one set because that's all I need. I don't need two of everything. Um, but I thought these are perfect. Also, if you're a crafter like me, cross-stitching, you could 100% make your notions, put your notions in here. And it's not like, I mean, it's, it's hinged, right? It's, this is some quality, decently quality. It's not... Yeah, they're hinge. It's not like it's plastic and gonna break. I mean, it is plastic, but like, but your hinge should break. But you can put your put some felt down, put your needles in here, your needle minder, some floss, whatever. I mean, scissors would fit in here. So either one could be a first aid kit, medicine, your beauty essentials. Put it in your travel toiletry. Put it in your bathroom. Put it in your office. Put it in your desk. I mean, post-it notes, a pen. Put it in your purse. These are nice and they're hard sided. They're like a little caboodle. They're hard sided, so whatever you put in there would be protected. It's kind of my thought. And then the last thing I got, which is new to me as well, in the summer section. So they've always had, or for a long time, they've had the little yard flags. But this, my friends, is a welcome sign. I was like, is that upside down? No. So you can hang it on your front porch. I can't show you the whole shebang. And it's like kite material, but it's big. And I'm gonna hang it right in my, by my front door and see how it does over there. And it just says, welcome. And it's in spring and they have a couple different ones, but it even has a little, um, like, I'm going to say in here is probably like a PVC pipe and it's glued onto it. And then your, your little hanger, you can hang it up. You could glue it down to something. I just thought that was so fun. Oh, and if you want to, if you hang it outside, there's grommets down here. So you could clip it to something and hook it so it doesn't blow away. I know, I thought that was exciting. I'm excited for spring, summer. All right, guys, well, there's my giant Dollar Tree haul today. Huge. I'm happy that I'm starting to see some spring stuff coming into the house. And, yeah, I've been doing my plants today. I've been repotting and moving things around and getting my... Sir, be nice, ma'am. Getting myself all together and ready for spring. I can't wait. All right, guys, I will talk with you later, and I hope you have a fantastic day.